Yeah. You, you can't escape your problem, man. You are the problem. So yeah. So back to the original point. Um, the common denominator between drug taking and that. People who do drugs, they're just trying to escape their problem. They're trying to pass time. Yeah. They have no purpose on this earth. Yeah. They haven't. They, sorry, they haven't found their purpose on this earth, and they ain't tried to find it. Yeah, not everyone's gonna know what their purpose is worth running, yeah, but they ain't trying to find it. Yeah, and that's a fucking problem. Mm -hmm. The need for relationships, yeah. Again, the common denominator between all of them, yeah, is you have no purpose, yeah. There's nothing wrong with wanting a relationship because you know you, you want to start a family or whatever in it, yeah. Build a dynasty as they want, call it and try and fashion um, you know. They want to try and make it out to be some kind of fashion thing, whatever in it, yeah, power couple bullshit, whatever in it. Yeah. That's cool, innit? Yeah, like you know, you want to you wanna you wanna start a family, whatever in it, yeah. But most people ain't even that. Most people are aiming because they want to start a family, whatever in it. Yeah. There's some people, they just can't bear to be alone. Yeah, they need companionship. Yeah. This is man we're talking about, you know. Not just yeah, we ain't, yeah, man them, yeah. Man needs compassion. Man can't be alone. I, I, I even been to someone's house recently. A woman said to me, my partner, yeah, he can't stand to be alone. Like she said to me, I, I, as in the woman said, she said, she said, she likes to be on her own. She said when she has the house to herself, oh, she loves it. Yeah. My partner on the other hand, oh, he can't stand to be alone. He doesn't know what to do with himself. Isn't it? I just think to myself, when I hear shit like that, I'm thinking to myself, this is a man who I know that woman runs the relationship or whatever, isn't it? Yeah? because he's needy. Yeah, he's needy. Well, go on, time. He's needy. Yeah, he can't stand on his own two feet. Yeah, he, he feels, again, that's what I'm saying about the common denominator between all of this is they feel like they have no purpose. When he's on his own and he hasn't got his missus around him, yeah, he doesn't know what to do with himself. He has no purpose. Yeah. He feels like he's just living for this relationship, yeah? But there are, there's man around me, yeah? Like, yeah, next door, yeah? Man goes and visits his girl, eh, like, Maybe I'm not normal, innit, yeah? But I don't see how a man could, every fucking weekend, every weekend, you know, every weekend, let me stress the point, every weekend, the man is at his girl's house. So, to me, yeah, someone who works Monday to Friday and on Saturday and Sunday, they're at their girlfriend's house. Not come past during the night, do their thing and bust out, yeah? So they might go there on the, in the night, do their little night mission and then they kick out in the morning. No, the man is pitched up there over the weekend, yeah? Anyone who is with their partner, yeah? Because remember, these people don't live together, innit? So the man, a man comes and stays over, innit, yeah? So... Any man who works Monday to Friday and then Saturday and Sunday, so he'll get to his girlfriend's house on Friday evening and leave on Sunday, innit? Yeah. The, this is this is general now, innit? Yeah. This is a lot of man, yeah. A lot of man who work Monday to Friday, Friday evening, they're at their girls' yard and they don't leave to Sunday. Yeah? So they spend the whole weekend with their Sunday. What you're basically telling that girl is if I didn't have a job and I didn't need to work, I'd spend every fucking day with you. Yeah? Because I have no purpose in life. Yeah, My purpose is you. This is why a lot of men commit suicide when they either, most of the time, it's when their girlfriend leaves them or sometimes their girlfriend passes away. Like I said in the live stream, the last live stream, that guy passed away, uh, um, a man's wife passed away and then he hung himself or he committed suicide. Yeah, But, but a man's got a you, you know. A man's got a child. The guy was so needy, he revolved his whole universe around his wife, yeah, that when she died, he felt like he had no fucking purpose, yeah? He didn't even feel like he had a purpose to be there for his child. His whole universe, his whole world was about that woman, yeah? And when she went there, he felt lost. That's why he killed himself. I can fucking guarantee, I don't even know this person, but I can put strong money on it, yeah? I'll put down a grand, yeah? That if one of his parents died, yeah, he would not have committed suicide. If one of his parents died, 
he would not have committed suicide. But because that woman is his sole purpose, like, you know, she is his fucking everything, right? He felt like, because she's not here no more, what is the point of me living? Yeah? That's what love will do to you, though. Know? Yeah? But it's not an excuse. Yeah, It's not a fucking excuse. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Yeah? Do not take your life. Yeah? Do not take your life. Do not take your life. Yeah? So, yeah. The reason why people, they have a need for relationships is not necessarily because they want to build a family, whatever in it. That's more of a byproduct, I'm telling you. Yeah, 99% of these people... It's because they just need companionship. Yeah, they can't stand to be alone. Yeah, like maybe I'm a weirdo or something like that. Isn't it? Yeah, but I actually like living in my house on my own. Yeah? maybe I'm a strange person. Maybe I'm just the ultimate lone wolf. Yeah, but I love living alone. Yeah, I love waking up and there's just no one here but me. Yeah? now some people be like, oh, it's just a little phase you're going through, and you no, 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 no. Because I don't walk around my house and feel like, oh, I wish I just had someone to talk to. You. I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I don't business. I don't business. I love my own space. I don't have a need for companionship. Yeah? If that makes me weird, that makes me weird. That's cool. Isn't it? Yeah? But at least I don't sit here thinking about, oh, you know, all I want is to just be with a woman. Yeah? This, is why, this is why a lot of men need women. Because yeah? they don't have no purpose in their life. Yeah. And when their women leave them or they, you know, pass away, which ain't in most cases, they want to take their life. So, again, the common denominator between drug taking, the need for relationships, reparations, is people, they have no purpose on this earth. Yeah. They're lost. Yeah. So I've spoken about the drug taking. Yeah. People need to pass time. They have no purpose. They need for relationships. Yeah. They have no purpose in this world, so they need companionship. Yeah, you know, you know, I've I've seen man right. So there's a man right that go to their girl's house. So remember, I said a man yeah works on Monday to Friday. He goes to his girl's house on a Friday. Listen to me and listen to me. Yeah, clearly. Yeah, this to be good. Should I say a man works on Monday to Ross Clark Friday? His girl does the night shift. Yeah, on Friday night. Yeah. So he finishes work, goes to her house. She's not even there. She's at work. She's doing the night shift. She don't come back till early hours of the morning, next morning. So you have such little purpose on this earth that you will sit for eight hours out of your life yeah, and wait for your missus to return. Yeah. You're, you have nothing going on. This is why we, this, this is why guys don't understand why women lose attraction. This is it. This is why women lose attraction because the guys become the women become the men's world. You you are moving. I'm telling you right now. Yeah, you're watching this right now. If you are a guy, yeah, you go to your girlfriend's house on a regular basis, yeah, and you sit and you wait for her to come back from work, and you sit down in your girlfriend's house for eight hours while she's at work. And then she comes back and you spend the next two days with her and you do that every single fucking week. You are a loser. You are a loser. I don't give a fuck if you're a doctor. Yeah? I don't give a fuck if you're a millionaire. You got a loser's mentality. Yeah? You got a needy mentality. Yeah? It should be the other fucking way around. Your girl should be sitting in your yard waiting for you to come back. Yeah? Not, not you waiting for your girl. Yeah? See, th this is how you get to determine who is the most valued in the relationship. Yeah? Who is sitting around waiting for the other person? Yeah, you think I'll be sitting around waiting for a girl? No, women need to sit around and wait for me, or or, or, or we ain't seeing each other in it. Yeah, there's no oh yeah, I'm just gonna be on a regular basis. I'm gonna be sitting there and waiting for my girl to turn up. Yeah, because my life is so shit. JYS is such a waste, man. That you know, without his girl, nothing's going on. I got nothing going on without my girl. Nothing's going on in my life.